Hey guys, I'm back. I just wanted to check in. I have managed to up my calories to almost 50% more. Um, big win. <laughs> my brain and everything, body is still way catching up, but I am improving. I was able to read my Bible today and take it in, which is the first time I've been able to really do that. And I got more in. I like totally understood what I was reading today for the first time in a while. Like I was able to retain some information. Um, but I was reading Ruth. I finished Ruth. Oh, I started, started and finished Ruth since it's short. Um, and I know there's a lot of prophecy in there. And I just need to, I haven't, I've been with a friend all day. And last did a night with a friend last night and a girl's night. Um, a much needed girl's night. It was so great. Um, and I haven't had the chance to do the research I want to do, but I'm going to do it because I have some ideas, but I got to, I got to talk with some people or someone, my mentor and tell her what I'm thinking and do some more research into it and bits and pieces and see if I have something there or if not, or if I understand what I think I understand. Um, not that it tells us anything different. It's just a thing I do. Um. But, let's see, uh, oh, guys, I just want to encourage you, the, there is so much spiritual attack going on, I just have, I have heard people wanting to give up, really, wanting to quit fighting, wanting to go take themselves home early, I want, you know, and meanness being spouted at each other, left and right, and, you know, we need to be careful with our words. And, you know, I don't really think I'm speaking to any one of you guys. Because I honestly, I can't think of anyone that I've talked to on this channel that has said anything mean ever. Um, just stuff I'm witnessing I really just um, in different places. It's just the, the spiritual attacks are heavy. I know I'm experiencing them like in my personal life heavy but and I'm sure you guys are too it's totally after our personal lives it's it's not going to be easy I think it's just going to get harder um but let's just you know um and just be I don't know what I'm going to go with that so I'm just going to say we've seen it I'm going to pray for it all right and heavenly father you know, I'm just, please help us see each other the way that you see us and speak to each other with the love that you would speak to us, Lord. Let me always speak to someone as you see them, Lord, and how, and how, and with their words and their, the way that you see it. Lord, let me convey that. Let me convey your love to them through me. You know, by following you, loving them, and I love them because you love them, and I follow you. That's how it works, Lord. So let my words be that. Let them be a reflection of that, of your love for them, because they are loved, Lord. So ridiculously, so much loved. Lord, I know that I love you. <laughs> and I just, you know, I just, I know you're going to get us through this, and you've gotten me through every single one of the little battles that I faced and they have not been easy Lord and it doesn't look like it's getting easier and the enemy doesn't look like he's letting up anytime soon but we got this Lord I know that you got this but I'm really just along for the ride in the show I guess I see it happen I feel the pain Lord but I know if I trust you and I understand the big picture of what you're doing here and what's going on. But the little stuff, it doesn't even matter. It doesn't even matter. It holds no weight. You know, it is nothing but a vapor. All of it. Useless. Nothing that matters, Lord, is coming with us. That we think matters now, I should say. It's coming with us. It doesn't matter. The only thing we're taking... Is our love for you, our relationships with each other, and our salvation, Lord. That's it. And who we are, I guess. 
or ish. I know we're going to be changed a bunch. Looking forward to it. But, you know, Lord, I just... Let me be the best me. And just to everyone until we get home. And just let my voice be a voice of love and a reflection of your love. That's all I want, Lord. That's all I can ask for. And I just speak. And please let me see everyone through your eyes always, Lord. Let me see their hearts and the way you see their hearts. And their hearts are truly beautiful, Lord. They really are. When we're looking at their heart, I know why you look at their hearts, Lord. I see it too. They're tr so beautiful. Lord, so thank you for such beautiful hearted brothers and sisters out there. And just for keeping us together and keeping the bride strong and helping the bride just we can do this lord and, and i just say i love you so much and i say that in the name of jesus christ amen okay you guys that's kind of i'm kind of tired um i've had kind of a crummy my mind and emotions are not at full functioning level i guess um, but I just really had a really fantastic time with some friends, and I got to spend some time with, um, I'm going to call them my nephews because I, they pretty much have been my family forever, so, um, my adopted nephews. So, anyway, I just love them so much, and it was just such a good weekend, or day, really, 24 hours. But it was great, and I'm back in bed, and I will talk to you guys in the next one or in the clouds.